So we've all heard about the Viva Max trailer where the team is about cosplay. So why is it an issue? It's because this company is different from other corn websites. This company is active in Facebook, which where most Filipinos uh, go online. The problem with Filipinos is that they suffer from a fallacy called hasty generalization. So hasty generalization, according to Scriber, is a claim made on the basis of insufficient evidence. Instead of looking into the examples and evidence that are much more in line with a typical or average situation, you draw a conclusion about a large population using a small, unrepresentative sample. Oh look, it's the perfect example for this shit show. <laughs> so basically, those who would see the trailer would just see the cosplay as sex, which is not true. Cosplay is not like that. So please, cosplay is not equal to porn. So let me define cosplay. According to William Webster's dictionary, it's the activity or practice of dressing up as a character from a work of fiction, such as a comic book, video game, or a television show. In simpler terms, cosplay is about bringing a fictional character to real life. And as we see, there's no mention of fear, great, uh, doing indecent acts, or anything like that. So I hope. To those parents who are watching this video that they won't misunderstand what cosplay is about i'll say it from time and time again cosplay is not equal to porn i would also like to point out that cosplay is not equal to consent this means that uh, you aren't allowed to do anything to the cosplayer just because they're portraying a character cosplayers are, are also human beings and you aren't allowed to break their law because they are different and that applies to uh, everyone, even in the internet. You can't just say whatever you want. Cosplay is a healthy hobby because it requires artistic ability to do cosplay. You need to do like sewing, uh, wig styling, what else? Makeup. You also need to do some uh, robotics if you really want to. Uh, go into the more detailed type of cosplay. You also need to craft using cardboards. So basically, you need to bring the character to life with all the materials that you can uh, get or afford. The things that you see in the trailer is like a very small minority of people who would uh, do those acts. So I hope that uh, the parents who watch this won't, or the unaware won't generalize what cosplay is we were simply introverts mostly who enjoys uh, dressing up as a character and to also improve our craft cosplay is not only a hobby but i believe it's also a way to earn money because there's actually a lot of people who earn a lot from them from uh wig stylists uh, makeup artists and some also uh, do costumes, like made to order costumes. My biggest concern for this issue is actually on the minors because uh, there's actually a lot of uh, incidents happening already about sexual harassment where some minors get told to do something and there's also a lot of comments on some cosplayers my days where they would uh, sexually harass people just because they do cosplay which is very terrible sorry if you're a student experiencing this from another student at your school you can report them to the guidance office or if they keep harassing you uh, you can ask some people for help or if you really want to uh, you can call them out if they really keep uh, insisting after you tell them to stop because i believe these types of people deserve to be <laughs> Shit it on. <laughs> to end this video, I'll just say one thing to all my fellow cosplayers out there. I'm sure this is a hard time to do cosplay because uh, those ignorant of what they see on that trailer would just assume that you do those kind of kinds of things. But don't let that stop you from doing what you love. I hope that you continue cosplaying for yourself. Don't cosplay for others. I believe if you cosplay for yourself, 
you wouldn't really mind uh, any uh, false rumors about yourself because uh, we, your fellow cosplayers, know that you don't do those kinds of stuff unless you admit that yourself. So I hope that this video is uh, informational to those who are not aware of what cosplay is. Thank you for watching the video and this is my first episode of TT Time and I hope that you like it. The logo is kinda rushed but you know. I gotta be fast when making a recent issue. If you like the video, comment what topic I should cover next or any issue that happened before or anything like that. I'm open to any topics. I hope that you will like the video and share it so that there will be less misunderstanding on what cosplay is truly about. Thank you. See you guys again soon. Bye boys.